Mancala. Mancala is all about planting. Like seeds? Oh, I see. You pick up the seeds and drop them in their little holes. You get to choose which of your pockets to move stones from. And these six pockets are mine? Yeah. The goal is to collect the most stones in your store. Sure, in case of famine. There's one other twist you should know. Yeah? If you drop your last stone in an empty pocket, it's capturing time. You can take your opponent's seeds. Nice. The game ends when one player runs out of stones in their pockets. So whoever has the most seeds in their store survives the winter. I mean, wins the game. How does it all work, you ask? We'll figure it out as we go. Said the grasshopper to the ant.
capture. 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 Dots and boxes. Ever played this one before? Don't think so. Where's the board? And the pieces? All you need for this one is a pen and paper. That's it? So I take it the rules aren't too complicated. There are basically just two. On your turn, you draw a line. When your line finishes a box, you get a point. Two rules for a 2D game. I'll give it a shot. What just happened? Oh, right. If you finish a box, you get to keep going. A third dimension.
ยาจไจส์ This game's kind of like poker, but with dice instead of cards. How you roll plays into which category you aim for. So I want to get more points than you in each category. Is that the size of it? Pretty much. Luck, don't fail me now. Huh? The three ones could be something. Yeah, I'll keep those and try the other two again. Fingers crossed. Nice. There's a fourth one. Huh? You're on a roll. <laughs> no puns. We talked about this. If I can just get one more, it'll be a yacht worth 50 points. Oh, rats! Didn't get the full set. So after the third roll, you have to pick a category. Yeah. Hmm. Four of a kind would be worth more here than aces, but this is the weakest four of a kind I could roll, so I'll save that one. Which means aces it is. You really have to think about which category to go with. So, are you ready to try? Let the good times roll.
Four in a row. Have you come to try and get four in a row before me? Token drop block! Falling circle counter! Crouching disc stance! Seeds of future victory! Hidden path strike! I'm so close! You fought honorably. We will duel again in winter!
Hit and blow. Oh, what's all this? It's a game where you guess at a set of hidden pegs. Oh, fun. Here's how it works. A brown peg means you have the right color in the right spot, like a direct hit. With you so far. A white peg means you've got the right color, but in the wrong place, or a glancing blow. So this means you have all four colors right, but only two are in the right place. Exactly. Let's assume red's in the right spot. What happens if I try this? Does that tell us anything? Um, well, what if I switch them around like so? I don't understand. This is taking forever. Let me try. I think you are on to something with that red one. Blue's obviously one of the bottom two, so let's put it here. But we have to make a change somewhere, so I'll swap purple and white. And voila! <laughs> Not bad, right? Oh, uh, way to learn from my mistakes. One hit, two blows. One hit, two blows. One hit, two blows. One hit, two blows. Zero hit, three blows. One hit, two blows. Zero hit, three blows. Three 
ました。